football, and we are continuing our preview series with a team that's hoping to make a leap this fall. The Burlington South Burlington Sea Seawolves, things haven't always been easy for them since the formation of the joint team back in 2018. Seawolves have posted just one winning season, and they're still hunting the program's first ever playoff win. Now, last year was especially tough. Burlington South Burlington only won two games, but Talent has never really been the issue for the Seawolves. The team brings back one of the most dynamic athletes in the state in Ahmed Diawara, and he and the rest of the Seawolves seniors made the point in the offseason and training camp to get more buy-in from the team as a whole. Now, both the upperclassmen and coaches believe that could pay dividends this fall. Obviously, I pay the part, but mainly it's mainly all of the guys because they show that they really want to come out in here and work because the last our last few seasons haven't been the greatest, like record wise. So we are just like willing to do what it takes to win. And I see like the determination in a lot of these guys and their faces when they're out here. Yeah, we had the um, the older guys from the previous years uh, talk with the coaches or maybe the coach asked some questions and they were really all saying like we need to just put in more work get in more practices and really just have more team bonding time what has been great is just the energy that the kids have been able to bring has been great um, I think one of the things we've asked them is we've asked them to work a little bit harder than they have in the past um, and they've responded you know uh, which is great we're, it seems to be a team wise we're not having to ask them to work hard there that's just what they do you know, we're always trying to encourage them to get better, but they seem to be willing to work, which is great.